Hey, TikTok. Food for thought. Does a woman hand in marriage equal the preservation of manhood? A thought I've had. Thinking on how oftentimes people have met me and they'll say, you'll make a good wife for my son. Sometimes I'm like, I don't even know you, nor do I know your son. But some kind of way they thought that that son getting with me equaled him becoming a man. So I'm just thinking, is this required? Is this one reason why we are having a battle of the sexes? It's because your hand in marriage is needed for the acquisition of a man becoming a man. Now, that puts the ladies in a, in a predicament because what if that's not what you want? What if that's not what you need? What if you're not ready for it? This is why a lot of men, they want you to hold on to very traditional values, which again, traditional values are not completely wrong or bad, but we do live in, and are in a society that is very changed and is very modern. You offering your hand, because that seems like more what it is, you accept it, but by you accepting it, it's almost validating that man to be a man because now he has something to do almost and the families embrace it. Do you agree? Does your hand in marriage equals the acquisition of manhood, the preservation of manhood? I've even heard men say, ladies, we need your cooperation. That cooperation, again, that submissive woman, um, that, that's woman that's cooperative, you know, that's one of those things that they desire. Is that really required for them to be a man? Because then on the other hand, they'll say, well, I'm a man. I was born a male. I'm a man. So which one is actually true? Just a question. Leave your comments.